my YouTube channel. So if you're new around here, oh, my name is Kat. And if you are coming back um, as a subscriber, cheers and thanks to you. It really, really is appreciated. Um, apologies for the lack of video. Um, I think it was last week. I think I posted one the week before. Um, it's just been really busy with the end of term and everything, but it's now the start of summer holidays. We're also having our building work done. So I can't remember in a couple of videos back, I said about we were having our garage done. So I'll make sure I do include um, a video of how that's going. Um, but yeah, so as we were having that done, um, my cupboards under the sink had to be all pulled out to drill some holes or something for the pipe work. So my, I'm just looking out, my kitchen is just a mess at the moment. Um, so I'll turn that around and show you what it looks like. I've got washing to put away, my island's a mess. Um, I've got plants in my sink, having a water, I've got bags on the floor which need to go away. So I thought I'd just bring you along for the tidy. Um, so it'll be a tidy and clean with me in the kitchen. Um, let me just show you these as well. So I got these from a child in my class, like how nice are these flowers? She came in and I was like, oh my God. So they're taking part of place in the kitchen at the moment. Um, and I've got some other flowers that one I'm going to take to my dad. Um, and one of them I'm going to put on the island once these ones have gone. Um, so yeah, so make sure you've got a cup of tea if you're watching or clean alongside me, put, put me on the telly. Um, yeah, and I'll show you what we get up to. So this is what the room currently looks like. So we've got stuff there that needs to go away, washing's on the line. All of this here needs to go into the cupboards down here. Um, that needs sorting out, I need to change the water there. That needs to be folded. And then I need to sort uh, these cupboards out, wipe all the sides. So yeah, that's what we're working with. Let's get into the video. Just start, I'm just going to move my method and back spray and a microfiber cloth cloth just to clean all of the inside of the cupboards. Um, and then it's starting to put all the alcohol and stuff away. It's funny because we don't even hardly drink alcohol at all anymore. Um, Jake went through a phase, well we both went through a phase of drinking like cocktails and stuff. Um, so we bought every kind of alcohol to do the cocktails, but we don't actually drink it anymore. So we've just got a cupboard full, I suppose, for guests and things. We'll get back into it. But yeah, so I was just trying to sort them out. So all the full bottles that weren't open towards the back and then the ones that had um, stuff that was open, only a little bit left, I tried to put at the front. in the bottle that is on the floor um, was some vodka we had left and then we'd made a creme brulee with some vanilla pods and instead of binning the vanilla pods we put it into the vodka and I think at this point Jake came in and went oh smell it and see um, what it smells like and it did actually smell of vanilla and you can see the colours gone different as well so I think it has um, like infused into it but yeah we'll see if it tastes any different so once done that one it was then onto the middle one you can see it's a bit of a mess it wasn't a mess and then I think um, it all been taken out to draw the holes and then just shoved back in um, I did have a couple more baskets from B&M, which you can see I'm just undoing now, um, just to try and make it a bit more organised. So I've got like hand gel in one, wipes in another. Um, I had some old re-diffusers, which I want to keep because they're like Christmas shaped ones. Um, and just an empty one that I like, like to bring out every now and again. Um, so yeah, trying to make that more organised. So again, clearing it all out, wiping it and then putting everything back where it needs to go.
then on to the last cover, which I realise the angle is really bad, so I do apologise. I didn't realise until after. Um, so this is like our tea and coffee um, cupboard. So the top stuff is like for the coffee beads of the machine, and the second one, um, the second part is like um, just the tea and coffee. That's an old coffee that obviously has been there for ages because it's gone at rock hard. Um, so again, just going in with the method, and then just sorting, um, so refilling the canisters with the tea and sugar that I had, and then just putting everything back in. I like to make it so the cupboards aren't full. I know that one in the middle just looked really full, but I know like everything is accessible and everything is where it needs to be. So then if I need to say to Jake, oh, can you get me this? I can say what's in this basket and this place. So just make it easy for you to really, and then you're more likely to put stuff away because it's in like an orderly place. Um, so yeah, that's just my thinking. And then once in all the inside, it's my usual drill with the outside of the doors anyway. Um, obviously just change the cloth. So again, just going in with the method and a microfiber cloth just to clean the doors. So I like to do this weekly anyway, um, or as I see, like if we've got greasy prints when we're cooking on stuff. Um, but obviously use these, we use these cupboards quite a lot. So if we've got anything in our hands, um, yeah, the marks you up. So just giving it a clean with the method before moving on to the dining room. And as you can see, um, it was a nice day actually, one of the very few nice days we've had. So just opening the door, I was getting quite hot actually. Um, and then what I did was I had sorted out the washing. Um, I did record it, but then when I watched it back, it was, I thought that's just really boring. Let me know if you do want to see me for my washing, but yeah, anyway. Um, and then just going in with the table. So just going in with um, some glass cleaner. Um, again, I think if you follow my Instagram, and I think I've mentioned this before, this table is like the bane of my life because it's glass. Um, it shows up every single mark and I feel like and for some reason like Jake's quite like greasy um, and that sounds really gross but just if he like even if he touched it with his like hand like I can see the mark there um, so yeah once done that then just doing the side with the normal polish um, before putting the flowers back and moving on to the islands so with the island it wasn't I wasn't doing a deep clean because I'd done the cupboard so I was feeling a bit fatigued at this point because it was quite hot um, and I've been on the go all day. Um, but yeah, so just going in with the method again, just to clean the hob, um, and then going in with the glass cleaner on, sorry, going in with the method on the island, and then the glass cleaner on the hob, uh, before moving on to do the cupboards, um, similar to the other ones, with the method and cloth on the doors. And also, I tried this as well. So um, I'd seen this online. So our hob, you've, I can lift out, but I need Jake to lift it out so I can get underneath. Um, so I don't understand. So I've got a credit card and if you like slide it along there, you can get all the crumbs and like dirt from around the edge of the island. Um, and I realise I'm really far away when I show you, but you can see that is disgusting. So it's well worth doing if you've got like an island in your, a, a hob in your island, like get a credit card or like that was just an extra card and run it down the side and you can get all the dirt out and it's very satisfying. It is gross, but it is very satisfying. i
Then it was time to hoover, so obviously just going in with the hoover. And I did also mop, but I did it later in the evening because um, I like to tend to do it before I go to bed so then it can dry properly. Um, and I forgot to get my camera back out to record it. Um, but yeah, that is usually my typical routine um, for cleaning the kitchen. Um, everything now speak and span so I hope that you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you want to stick around for more don't forget to hit subscribe also follow me on my Instagram which is r underscore sorry r number underscore 41 I'm not good if you don't know your own handle um, for like pictures and I usually post daily and like little reels and stuff so yeah I hope you have enjoyed the rest of your day whenever you're watching this and I'll see you in the next one guys bye